Hey, this is Logan Wild, the Commissioner of Agriculture and Food for the State of Utah, giving you a weekly update. Um, there's a couple things that we want to run past you real quick. Is um, We've had an uptick in meat processing requests here in the State of Utah. As a Department of Agriculture and Foods, it is our responsibility to make sure that these um, have inspectors that are there on the floor. So we're in the process of making sure that these processing plants get up and going. Another thing that we're really happy to talk about today is the COVID-19 re, um, relief grant to producers. We are about halfway through that money right now and we have um, really optimistic about the direction that's going. Some of the, the uh, stories that we're hearing back from our producers is just making it very optimistic and that we're able to help um, food pro or the agriculture producers here across the state. Um, this week we also had a food vulnerability meeting where we brought in stakeholders into the Department of Ag to discuss some of the vulnerability that was been made aware of during the COVID-19. Um, we're trying to find remedies for some of these concerns. Um, just like what you've noticed is that some of these concerns work in their way out, but we want to make sure that we have safe and secure food on your table um, when you sit down to eat at night. The last thing we want to talk about is the farmers markets that are happening across the state. Um, these local farmers markets have been meeting with the local health departments to meet the requirements of the COVID-19 pandemic. Um, every one of them has been able to qualify and they're open in across the state of Utah. We are happy to see that we have safe and secure food that you can go to these farmers markets and purchase. And we want to give a big shout out to those that have really put their life and uh, business on the line to make sure that you still have food here in the state of Utah. Um, with that, we'll wait for the next update coming next week. Have a happy July.